In this video I'll show you the best team in Season 20 in Axie Infinity. Not only the team, but also different matches to see how it works. Hey Axie Rankers, this is definitely the best team in Season 20. It's everywhere in high ranks and flooding the top 50 right now. There are a few variations like I've shown in the previous videos, and people are still trying to find out what works the best, but it's definitely the winner of the last updates. Now, I'm testing a new variation using an Aqua instead of the Mech or Beast, and I'll explain why in a few seconds. First I'm using the God Reptile in the backline again. I've tested this and the variation of the Tri Spikes, and I find this more consistent against Mech backliners. He uses the popular Scaly Spoon and Indian Star for the Reflect damage. Kotaro for the energy gain and Tiny Dino for damage. This time, I'll be using an Aqua as I said before. Reason being, that I'm finding a lot of mirror matches in the arena, just like this one I'll show you in a few seconds. By having an Aqua midliner, I can beat their beasts or mechs since I'm faster, otherwise a lot of the time I wouldn't take value from my midliner. He uses Risky Fish and Arco to speed up against other Aquas or birds. Scarab is really important here, as one of the teams that counters my god reptile is a team that is healing backliners with Zigzag or Shiitake, so I can deny their healing. And finally Nemo for the energy gain to help the god reptile in the late game. And finally a plant tank with damage and energy control. I'll probably change this tomorrow as well, as I feel it needs more shield. Oh and by the way, I got to around 2.5k MMR yesterday with this team. Opponent will be playing a similar team. His tank is more of an utility tank with Leaf Bug and Sirius. His midliner is a Remp Mech. You see, with my Aqua I'll be faster than this guy. And finally a God Reptile as well. I'll not comment so much today, just let you enjoy the gameplay. Let me know if you have any questions below. This was one of the situations I talked about before. My Aqua is faster so I can at least damage the mech before he dies. Now this is like a chess play. Whoever does a mistake first loses.
In this game, I'll be fighting another popular matchup. A mech reptile plant team. But with a reptile in the back, which should be a bad matchup for my team right? Just look at this BS. Now the reptile against the mech. Game 3, I'll be fighting against a poison team. The plant is in utility yam plant with pincer 2. The midliner is a winghorn, tiny turtle, garish worm and grass snake dusk. Again, another situation where my aqua will have value by being faster. And finally another dust that can really destroy my team by being able to heal in the late game. This is an example of where you need cards like Scarab to win. Now I'm going for the Scarab play, to make sure he doesn't heal and I can finish him off soon. And that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, please leave a like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, keep climbing the ranks.